So as you can see, this is me before. See the sending in there. And then the receding. And we're gonna go get a change. Let's go. So the deed has been done. And I feel fantastic. Loving it. Makes me feel better, rejuvenated. Thank you, Bold Cafe, for getting me here. Three, four days now since it's happened. And nothing but compliments, nothing but good feedback. I love it myself too. It's growing a bit back here, but yep. When I was about 15, it started off with me not being, um, or oh, using too much product in my hair. I used to have the, the comb over style uh, line on the side here and just like a fade. Since I was 15, that's been my haircut since. And uh, as I was getting older, I used to have a pretty deep widow's peak and it just slowly, with all the product I was using, I was spraying hairspray. I was all the possible things you could think of to keep my hair up because it was very thin. So it was very, as soon as I put it up, it would just flat. My dad's losing a lot of hair and my family has hair loss, I guess, in there, in the men and caught up to me the quickest. I didn't really care what I looked like. It was more just my hair is my hair, deal with it, whatever. And then recently, I'd say in the past two years, year and a half, I've been seeing a significant difference from what it was. As you can see, my hairline. Again, I didn't really care, but I did wear hats. So like subconsciously, I think I was covering up. I thought I didn't care, but I guess it did affect me. And um, just recently, I started a business with my uh, best friend and we have a food truck. Coming with the food truck, we had reviews, we had obviously videos, pictures, everything getting taken to get the business up and going properly. And I could see my hair in those pictures and it was affecting me the most. It's like, as soon as I see those pictures, I would see my hair and my hairline. And it was something I couldn't overlook. And so I tried to, cut, I would cover it, I'd wear a hat. Obviously when I'm cooking as well, I'd wear a hat because I didn't want hair to go in because I was losing lots of hair. And I think it also became with the stress of opening a business, but the business is doing well and everything's going good, except for my hair, that was the only problem. At least that I was looking at. First, I thought to myself, I'm just gonna shave my head, no questions asked. And then as soon as you say that, it's like instant fear in your head, like, okay, losing hair, am I gonna look too old? Is my head the right shape? Is it this, is it that? Just a laundry list of potential issues that I saw when I shaved my head. Oh, if I was to shave my head. But then I, I started YouTubing just hairline receding, shave head, and Bold Cafe was popping up left, right, and center. And I just started watching, and I saw the the good feedback that everyone was giving once they had done it, the, the feeling of not having to worry about it. And I honestly can say that it was the best decision for me ever, I think, to shave my head. And it's, it's fantastic. I mean, I'm just... The only difference is... is that I saw the most that affect not really affected me, but as soon as I shaved it, I was like, oh, uh oh, it was the color. And that's because I just need a little bit of sun because this was a full head of hair at one point. So I can understand why that's happening. But other than that, I think it suits me and I, I'm really happy. Feedback's been great. My girlfriend hasn't let me, left me, so that's fantastic. And I know she wouldn't have, but it's all this, this fear goes through your head and my my advice to people, men out there, even women, um, it doesn't identify you. Like you can use it as a de uh, as an identity, but it does not identify who you are. That's what you do. It just shows people, and people will never look at your hair and be like, "Oh, he's a weirdo. He's this. She's that." It's more just how you present yourself, and that's why I was very much okay with shaving my head. My advice to all the men and women out there that need. The advice is do it and you will never look back. It, or at least do it. And if you don't like it, you could say you've done it. You could say you've tried. I don't think I'm ever growing this back. It's I'm loving it. It's working with me and I feel great. And so I just, again, like to thank Harry and um, YouTube Bold Cafe. It's just 
it worked with me and I'll tell everyone out there, you got to do it too.